Λεμπρόν έξω. Πρόσω. for Anthusa's whereabouts. Oh. Are you Anthusa? Me? Anthusa? I could be anyone for you, lamb. I charge less than the Etera. But do I ever know my way around the haybed? So her name means something to you? Anthusa? She's been around forever, but I never met her. I know the Etera all work as one, on equal footing, but Anthusa's special. She talks, they listen. I haven't met any Etera yet. Don't believe all you hear. They sell what a lot of us sell in Corinth, but for them, it's not just about the flesh. They're merchants of a sort, streetwise can talk as nice as they look. Sounds like a good trade to work in. You don't want to be an Etera? Not in my prime anymore, am I, Miss Dios? By the time I study what they did, I'll be serving clients on my deathbed. If the Etera aren't here, where are they? Their swords are too high and mighty to be down here in the dirt with us. You want them, you'll find them upon the hill. The Acrocorinth. By the temple, keeping Aphrodite's worshippers satisfied. I'm here to worship Aphrodite, but the view is the real beauty. Where are they? The Etera aren't here. Then you're going to pay for the trouble we went through. is dedicated to them, the brutes. <sighs> the thieves are here and the Etera aren't. The Etera? <laughs> They're much wiser than we are. They realize their visitors were all getting robbed on the way in. There's no avoiding the mongers men in Corinth. <laughs> Who 
walks around with a name like the Monger. Don't let him hear you say that. Last time his name came out of a fool's mouth, the man's tongue was sliced out. So the Monger is a Corinthian criminal? Master of the underground markets. He rules with one hand open for money and the other clenched around a weapon. A drachmi and blood-hungry monsters what he is. So he's hunting the Atera? For money? Exactly. Since the Atera bring in so much drachmi, he wants everything they control. The thieves are better off robbing them than us. If you know of the Atera, then you know of Anthusa. I'm looking for her. They say she's everywhere, though I've never seen her. But the Edera see everything. I've seen them gather by the spring of Pireni, down the mountain. They meet clients there and then take them elsewhere in secret. Good. Maybe pray to Aphrodite from home next time. <gasps> It shouldn't be long now. No, it won't be. I'm sure of it. Ah, so Cassandra has finally found us. You know me? And you know her. This is Anthusa. We saw you help the worshippers at the Temple of Aphrodite. You've proven yourself a friend. Hear that, Icarus? Her sight's as good as yours. Someone also spoke very highly of you. Surprise! Phoebe! Aspasia sent me. I work for her now, remember? But why here? Corinth isn't safe. I had to tell Antusa you were coming. Aspasia taught me a new word, emissari. That's me. And now Cassandra and I have met. See? This is easy. And now I can help you. I guess that would be all right. Who knows what I'll get into. Yes! Just make sure you're extra careful. We need to move inside, Cassandra. We're not the only ones watching. Come with me, and we'll talk. Can I come? As long as you're quiet. To what do I owe your visit? Alcibiades told me about you. <laughs> Did he? Go on. I'm looking for a woman from Sparta. A runaway. Long ago. She may have gone by the name of Mirini. Who's that? She's my mother. Your mother? You don't have a mother. Marcos told me he raised you. What did I tell you about talking? I see. There will be time to respond to your question, but that time isn't now. As long as you tell me what you know, sooner or later. You will have to trust me. You don't get to where I stand without credibility. My word is yours. And you can always trust Cassandra. Why don't you go play, Phoebe? Let me and Anthusa talk. If you say so... I propose a trade. Help me. Help us get stronger. Strong enough to rid Corinth of the monger permanently. A simple transaction, I assure you. You have a deal. A wise decision, dear Mystios. I haven't made it this far being a fool. I know when to take a chance. Then we're in business. Now, you've heard of the monger? From what the worshippers say, he's someone I should watch out for. They're right. I'm sure his victims wish they'd been more vigilant. My eyes are wide open. Then you've held your ground well. You're not dead. Not yet, anyway. But he's employed enough thugs to amass a small army. Now they're attacking people in the street, us included. He's been killing a terror? Killing? We're smarter than that. But action must be taken before it goes that far. I'm not the only one who needs help. My girls, Damalis and Irina, are suffering too. More monger trouble? I wouldn't doubt it. Work against their aggressors, and then it will be his turn to suffer. You'll find the Malis here at the spring, but Irina has gone to Bellerophron's garden. 
What's wrong with Irina? She's looking for Cleo, another Etera, who's gone missing. I've been too distracted to help in the search. Has Damaris told you what's wrong? She hasn't told me much, but I know these girls as well as I know myself. Something's not right. I'll see what I can do for them. Good. The monger feeds his thugs. With a drachmi, he makes smuggling. Weapons, mostly. Which is all the more lucrative now that he has a war to supply. So, if someone interrupts the monger's supply, his men go hungry. Exactly. Go to his warehouse in the port of Lecheo and burn his cargo. All of it. We'll let chaos take care of the rest. Why rob people who can't put two drachmi together if he has a business? It's illegitimate, but gets him rich. Even the smuggling is a front. He steals slaves, innocents, who shouldn't be harmed, but his thugs can burn. Seems to me that burning his biggest source of income is asking for trouble. I want to put the new muscle I've acquired on show. Plus, violence is the only language he understands. I know many people who speak that language. Then the warehouse will be cinders. Don't ask any questions. Let's keep out of sight. This is the place. Time to burn some cargo. Tight. Go!
you fight like a Spartan. There's resolve in you. We have that in common. I saw innocents trapped in the flames. The ones in the warehouse. I freed them already. A good soldier acts when he's told. A great one is two steps ahead. Thank you. My name's Cassandra. I'd thank you too, if I knew who you were. Razidas of Sparta. You're a newcomer to Corinth. You're a spy too? An old Spartan tactic? <sighs> I have my ways. I get the sense that's a Corinthian hobby. Anthusa has her Etera watching from every post. Ah, Anthusa. We disagree, but have a common enemy. The monger? We agree he should be killed, but we differ on how. So, Sparta also has a monger problem. What do you know about him? His weapon has a far reach. Corinth is allied with Sparta. It's our duty to protect them. Then working alongside Anthusa is your best bet. If she had her way, the Mongol would be flayed in the streets. Sparta wants him dealt with quietly. What do you want to do with him? Right now, the Mongol rules Corinth. I want to replace him with minimal bloodshed. He'll only be dethroned if he's killed. It's simple. Yes. Diplomacy isn't something he understands. From what I hear, I'm not surprised. We arrested his top men, armed the citizens, tried to stir the police against him. It never came to be. The only thing left to try is a quick slice of the blade. That would do it. We'd lure him into Corinthia's sacred cave, and it'd be over. By the time I leave, Corinthia, the monger will be dead. Do that, and Sparta will be in your debt. I was Spartan, once. Once? Until I was thrown off Mount Taietos as a child, and left for dead. You're the daughter of General Nicolaus? All of Sparta knows your name! And here you are, alive! Impossible! I survived. I raised myself alone while life continued in Sparta. Never mind being a Spartan. Those of good character will forgive and should be forgiven. I'm on the hunt for my mother, Mirini. And the only way is through Anthusa. Yes, Merini. You don't know anything about Merini, do you? I know that no one should have to endure such tragedy alone. And I heard she left Sparta that night. No one has forgotten Merini. From what I know, she wanted them to forget. You knew Nikolaus? A good general, but a stubborn Spartan. And rewarded for his loyalty. But he disappeared, and his body was never found. The state pronounced him dead. That's all right. I haven't seen him since I was a child. There's no going back now. The displaced can always find their way home. The gods have just decided you must fight for it. They couldn't make it any easier. Chin up, Spartan. Easy doesn't exist. Goodbye, Brasidas. We'll meet again. I'm in the fight with you. Show courage. Until the Mongol. We're not sure why he came here, but Corinth is worse off because of him. Cleo!
by Aphrodite. Cleo better get back here soon. Why call on the gods when you have one of their messengers at your service? How did you know I needed help? Anthusa told me you could use a hand. Cleo, one of our girls, didn't meet me for prayer this morning. She wasn't at home either. I'd go investigate, but I'm not sure what I could do on my own. She might have been taken. I asked around. One of our clients said he saw Cleo brought aboard the ship. The men were armed, so there was nothing he could do. I'd pay a lot of drachmi to get her back. Armed? Take me to the ship. We'll get Cleo back. Follow me. Who do you think took her? It wouldn't be the first time the mongers' men came after one of us. <gasps> there. That's the boat our client described. Please, get her back safely. Ready, yours! Let's move in! Rescue you. Rescue me. You sunk my boat, pirate. Put the knife away. I'm a friend. What do you mean? Your friend Erina hired me to save you from these men and bring you back. Erina? I commissioned that ship to steal me away from Corinth. You're escaping? From what? You have no idea what the monger does to people. The things I've seen, no one in Corinth is safe. Erina thought you were abducted. She clearly cares about you. If she cared about me, she'd let me go. Even Anthusa can't keep us safe anymore. She clearly disagrees. Mistios, please. We were heading to Mykonos, which is safe. If you'll take me there, I can pay you the toll I would have paid my crew. Anthusa will take care of you. You need to go back to Corinth. It's your home. Take me against my wishes then. I won't fight you. Cleo! Oh, did they hurt you? I prayed to Tihi for your safe return. I'm fine, I'm fine. There'd better not be a scratch on you. I promised this mercenary a month's salary to have you back in one piece. You did? Of course! You're my dear sister. I'm so thankful Cleo is home. Please, take this for your trouble. Good luck to both of you. 